This video will show you how to replace the valve on your Kohler tow car inline bathroom sink faucet. For this servicing, you will need the following tools. 2.5 mm hex wrench, adjustable wrench, and painter's tape. Turn off the water supplies. Move the handle to the on position to relieve water pressure. Cover the drain with painter's tape to avoid the loss of small parts. Using a 2.5 mm hex wrench, loosen the set screw on the back of the spout. Move the spout back and forth while pulling up, and remove it from the faucet body. Remove both washers and the handle from the faucet body. Using an adjustable wrench, remove the mounting nut. Remove the adapter assembly. Then remove the white and brass pieces from inside the assembly. Remove and discard the old valve. Insert the new valve into the faucet body so the posts line up with the holes inside of the body. Note the posts are different sizes. Make sure each post is properly seated before continuing. Turn the valve stem fully counterclockwise. Install the brass adapter onto the valve stem. Then orient the arrow on the white adapter down and install it to the brass adapter. Align the tabs on the white adapter to the front and back. Align the tabs on the spout adapter with the notches in the faucet body and install the spout adapter to the white adapter. Hand tighten the mounting nut. Using an adjustable wrench, tighten the nut until secure. Reinstall the large washer. Then reinstall the handle by aligning the internal slots on the handle with the tabs on the white adapter. Install the small washer over the handle. Reinstall the spout by aligning the internal notches with the tabs on the spout adapter. Using a 2.5 mm hex wrench, securely tighten the set screw. Remove the painter's tape from the drain. Turn on the water supplies. Check all connections above and below the counter for leaks. Run water to confirm proper operation. Identify and purchase only genuine Kohler service parts to maintain optimum performance of your product.